WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman, the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour coming up straight after this TFNN update. This is noontime. The Dow's down 214. It was up 130 points earlier on. Now it's down 215 at 26,700. Remember, we've been talking about this for a long time. Maybe it's it's actually over three weeks. It's since the high that was made back on the 12th of July, 27,306. The uh, objective was to look at the way the MACD, the moving average and, and convergence divergence and the stochastic, as well as moving averages were working. And my contention was that we'd be looking at time rather than price with slightly lower highs and slightly lower lows over a period of time. It's taken right up until today. And even now, we haven't got the crossover negative in the um, two key moving averages. So that's important. It should happen by the end of the day. We'll see. Day's young. Most importantly, what we're looking at is that the S&P has also done the same thing. The S&P is now down 23. Before, it was just the down that was down the most. Now it is the S&P that's catching up, down 23 at 29.53. It, too, is, in fact, in right at this moment, the day's young. It's a daily chart. But for the first time, we've got a crossover to the negative side of the moving averages that it's really important. That makes it 29.40. 42 to 29.38 support, very important to hold. The QQQ is, has done, it already did that a couple of days ago, crossed negative. It is, uh, the high was 194.71, uh, most recent high. And what we're looking at here is that at 187.88 needs to hold 185 this week, otherwise, is a real problem. If you look at the IWM, the IWM was trying recently to act in a bravura way to say, hey, I'm independent of the market. I can move higher. Uh-uh, it couldn't do that. It's now very negative at 150.46. It has to hold 149.10. And if you look at gold, gold was weak earlier on. Now it's up quite sharply, up 17 at 14.90. The dollar made a new recovery high. That's really important. Now it can have a bit of a rest. It went to uh, all right here. It's looking uh, down 0.17 at 99.23. So um, it's in the resistance area, but it's had a fabulous move up. Can have a little bit of a break right now. If you're looking at the uh, TLT, that is bonds, the TLT right now trading at um, 143.67 up 59. We might see money go back into bonds, the so-called safety of bonds, as it comes out the illiquidity. Well. Let's put it this way, the risk in the stock market. Basil Chapman will do a lot more in the next show coming up in another couple of minutes. The Tiger Technician's out. If you haven't checked out the newsletters page of TFNN.com,